what is up guys welcome back to another video so today is going to be another day in the life another bit of a vlog because you guys really seem to enjoy those ones i'm just having some water and the morning coffee and then me and laura are going to hit the morning workout so i've actually changed my morning routine slightly so instead of like working out later on in the day as soon as we wake up get the workout done then go for a morning walk then and then crack on with what work needs to be done for the day. Fridge is running pretty low. Water for the workout. So this is the workout attire. We've got a little tank top. This is like a sulfate old sample. We've got some my protein shorts and then some Adidas socks. Yeah. Right guys, so I managed to pick up some dumbbells from Argos. They're only 10 kilos, but do you know what I mean? It's better than nothing. So we're gonna do a bit of a a bit of a back and tricep session because yesterday we did chest, shoulders and biceps. It's pretty nice, just like for the first time lifting weights in about five, six weeks. It's like bloody hell, like I miss it a lot. So I've already lost a lot of muscle size, not in the best shape, but it's just one of those things, isn't it? Got to deal with it. So I'm going to do a quick session and then we'll go for the walk. But yeah, let's go with it. What is up guys, right, so workout done. Decent little workout. To be honest, I can tell that I've like lost a bit of muscle during this lockdown period. It's like the gym has been shut now for like six, seven weeks. So I've not been able to like train weights for like over a month, which is like the longest time. I've not trained for like five years, maybe. I've still been doing home workouts and running and that, but I just feel like a bit flatter and a bit, do you know what I mean? Like muscle is probably like just, it's gonna come back obviously when the gym's open, but I've only just got the 10 kilos and that is quite a lightweight, you know what I mean? So I've ordered some more dumbbells. Don't know when they're gonna come, like 25s and 17s. That'll make it a bit better. Um, but hopefully the gyms will open back soon again. If you wanna try that workout, just give it a try. It's quite nice and easy. It's, it's decent, yeah, a good little sweat on. But I've just packed some sulfate orders. We're gonna go and post these at the post office. And I just wanted to talk to you quickly about sulfur because I've just recently restocked all the Aura joggers um, in black, jet black and triple black. So if you want to check them out, they'll be linked in the description. There's um, limited stock, but you know what I mean? There's going to be loads more stock coming. Like Because I've had more orders these past few months, I need to up the volume of my quantities when I start to order. Um, but you guys always ask me to talk about the business a bit more. So, you know what I mean? I thought I'd keep you in the loop and I'm bringing out some jogger shorts that'll be coming probably the end of May we've got premium t-shirts in black and like a really nice lava grey they're going to be coming very soon probably in the next week or two weeks so keep an eye out on my Instagram because I'll be posting it on there and I'll be restocking the navy and grey joggers as well but yeah I'm going to go and post these now Oh, it's for you, Lord. Oh. 
All right, guys, so we just got back from the morning walk. Pretty long, to be honest. Like, I'm already on nearly 12,000 steps, so decent morning cardio. I've not eaten yet for the day, so I'm just going to have some overnight oats, which I made yesterday. Um, 50 grams of oats, 25 grams of whey isolate for my protein, and a little bit of almond milk. A little bit of cinnamon, just stir it up and then leave it in the fridge overnight. It'll harden. And we're just going to have some strawberries on top of that. I'm going to cut them up and put them on top. And then a little bit of honey, I think, just to go on the top. And we've also got something from Muscle Food because he sent me out a massive like order yesterday. It's called Live Lean. It's basically you get a morning meal, a morning snack, lunch, afternoon snack, and then like an evening meal like tea or dinner, however people want to call it. And you can do that for like five, six or seven days. So they just sent it me out to try, so I'm trying it. I'm gonna do a full day of eating soon. I'm gonna like do a bit of a taste test on all the products. Let's beat. This is one of the products, I think. It actually looks pretty nice. So it's like sausage, Ooh. beans and potatoes. I just need to mix it up though. That actually smells very but nice. But I think it's just, just for people who are like always in a rush, who can't go out of the house, you know what I mean? It's good for that. I actually enjoy cooking, so it's kind of a toss up. Yeah, let me just stir this up. Let's get a close up of the honey. Just a little bit of honey. Added chocolate chips as well. Ideal. Right, so added a few chocolate chips as well, guys, just because it's like six grams in it makes it taste well nice. But this is a really nice and easy meal you can prep in advance and then cook and it's very good macros. This is the first meal of the day. We're gonna try that as well, but it's like, I'm just trying it. It's not part of the meal, but hopefully the muscle food stuff's nice. I mean, he sent loads of stuff out, so definitely be trying it on, letting you guys know. All right, come on, Laura. Gonna have them. Which one? All right, so we're gonna try it first. It actually does look, you know like when you're on a plane, it looks a bit like aeroplane food, which I always like to be honest. So say it has been sausages, it's gonna be dead hot. You're gonna say that's gonna burn you, I think. Very hot. It's actually not bad though, you know. How many calories is it? Let's have a look. Per pot, 374. 26 grams of protein as well. Not bad, if you're like in a rush and you can't be asked making breakfast, it's decent. I'll try it. Mm. That was actually surprisingly very nice, you know. If I got that on a plane, I'd be very happy. Wouldn't you as well? Yeah. Yeah. 26 grams of protein, not bad at all. They need to send me a few more of those bad boys out, but we're gonna have the proper breakfast now, which is the overnight oats. I much prefer overnight oats to porridge with protein in because warm pro warm oats with uh, protein powder in it, I think it, the texture is disgusting. Like those dead and mushy, warm protein is not for me. So I much prefer this. Tell me what you think. Get a bit of oats in there. Dig down. Dig down. Dig down deep, deep, deep. Nice. Very nice. I think the salted caramel oh, flavour. Flavour protein. Yeah, it's well nice. Smells well nice as well. All right, guys. So got ready. Just wearing a polo. I don't know if you see the light there. Just wearing a polo shirt. Some legend London jeans. We're gonna get the Instagram pic in a bit, but I'm gonna get a snack. Laura, I'm gonna get a protein bar. Do you want one? We can eat in a bit if you want. All right. I'm gonna get a protein bar because. Um, it's pretty late in the day, you know, it's like three o'clock. Um, but I'm just gonna get it to tide us over. So I've got this, I'm gonna have this grenade carb killer. Muscle Food actually sent me this out as well. I think Laura, we've got so many protein bars, guys. Look at the collection. So we've got PhD, um, all these optimal nutrition, Whipped Bites, Mars Protein, and then uh, um, Muscle Food sent me all these ones out to try. Um, so many. This one I had yesterday, it was so fucking nice, honestly. Tasted like the one. We've got grenade, carb killers, um, white chocolate, and Jaffa cake. Laura likes these ones, I think these are her favorite. My protein, Rocky Road. 
I'll give her that and then we've got more in here from my protein. We've got wafers, clusters, crispies. There's too many. I know it's like a little sh corner shop. Don't even ask. Say that again for the camera, Joss. Sit down and enjoy your lunch. So we've got a ham sandwich and I made Laura tuna because she loves tuna. Mm. I've got a little bit of tuna as well. Josh well, we'll loves the tuna. Got some baked crisps, I think. Yep. It's like half four now, so it's like nearly bloody tea time, but this, the days go rapid in lockdown, I think, you know. Dead fast. Wow. Right guys, so it's been a little while after um, we had lunch. I got a new phone as well, I forgot to tell you. I got an iPhone 11, which is very nice. So before I had an iPhone 8 Plus, which is the one on the right. Now I've got an 11. It's a little bit smaller, which is probably better for me because I struggle to fit this one in my pockets. But yeah, it's really nice so far. I just need to get a case for it and stuff, but it's about time I got a new phone. I've had this one for like three years now. There's nothing wrong with it actually. It's done me really well. It's a sick phone. It's just, I fancied a bit of an upgrade. So I'm just choosing the outfit for tonight's Instagram post and I'm just gonna pair it with some accessories. I've got a massive accessories box here. Most of them are rose gold and black. I think we're gonna wear, wear a rose gold and black minimal watch, which is really nice and clean. And then we're gonna put that with Maybe like a grey minimal bracelet and then if I can get in this bottom one a nice bar necklace as well. So these are the accessories I always go for. I get loads of questions where I get my bracelets, my necklaces from. It is rose gold and black. Make sure you go and check them out guys. They are today's video sponsor. Honestly they always hook you up. Such nice accessories for the price as well. And with my special discount you get 30% off the whole website which is very ideal, really high quality. They always bring in new styles out, new designs. They've got so many different colors to choose from as well, but this one is probably my favorite necklace. I'm sure you've heard me speak about them before. It's gonna be linked, the top one in the description. If you just wanna like spruce up your outfit, just change it up a little bit. I think accessories are a really good way to do that as well. So like I said, first link in the description, go and check them out. I'm just gonna get ready now. And I'll show you what I'll look like when I'm ready. You getting ready as well? Yeah. I think we might get a pick together actually. What have we got? Misguided. Body. Body. Mum jeans. What shoes? Oswego's. I think the grey ones. Yeah, that'll be nice. Alright guys, this is the outfit. We've got the accessories on. Looking clean. We've got a tailored athlete shirt, which is a very nice fit. And then we've got some legend London jeans. I'm just gonna whack some Alexander McQueen's on, to be honest. Not done a post with Alexander McQueen's for a while, you know, because I've been wearing the cheaper version, the Bershka ones, which are sick to be honest, but you know, I'm gonna mix it back up. We're gonna whack those back in. I just need to get them nice and clean. Um, but I'm gonna be doing lots more trainer videos, I've decided. Lots more content coming, you know the drill by now. Three videos a week. All right, so we've got the pick all nice and sorted. I'm gonna put a picture of it on the screen here. Literally always taking um, Instagram pictures on my own with a tripod and a timer on my phone. So it's pretty cool, you know, it's pretty cool that you can do that. You don't need a dead expensive photographer, all this bullshit. You can do it yourself. Just get a decent camera where it's got like a self timer thing on it, which can help you out. But it's nearly tea time or as a lot of people call it dinner time. Because I'm from the north, I've always called it tea time. What, what what do you do in the comments, guys? What do you call it? It's defo tea time. I think Laura calls it dinner time, but it's not. Don't get me wrong, guys. Nice clothes make you feel good. It's nice to get dressed up now and again, but you cannot be a nice t-shirt, some comfy shorts, or some joggers, a nice hoodie, wearing around around the house, especially nowadays, like, because we're locked in, do you know what I mean? It's just nice to wear comfy clothes. I've literally been living in the sulfate joggers. I've been living in nice, oversized t-shirts. Just the one. Bought for Instagram, obviously. I'm gonna look nice, so that's why I have to get dressed up. If you wanna check me out on Instagram, I post like daily outfit inspiration. Like I'll put it on the screen for you. It's just Joshul underscore, but we're about to get some food now. It's not ready yet. Veggie's just walking the same way. Mm. 
What's this outfit called? This is called Quarantine. The back garden. <laughs> Keepy uppy. <laughs> comfy outfit. Oh. Quite nice. Oh, oh, oh. Very close Such to me. Has come back to me, don't worry. Oh, it's jinxed it. <laughs> jinxed it. I'm gonna wrap up the vlog there guys, so it's pretty late now, I think it's like 10 to 11 at night, that is today's video, today's day in the life, and um, at night me and Laura just tend to chill and watch like a, a few series, at the minute I think we're watching Modern Family and Lisa Vanderpump, and no, what is it, Vanderpump Rules, uh -huh. it's actually pretty good you know, it's like, it's a bit like reality TV, it's similar to like the Kardashians, Honestly, don't judge me before you watch it. You need to have a watch for it. It's, it's addictive, it's very decent. But um, yeah, I'll catch you on the next video. If you wanna check out today's video sponsor, Rose Gold and Black, like I said, that is gonna be linked in the description down below. Best accessories you're gonna find for the price and the quality. But yeah, I think that is it for me today. So take care guys, stay safe. See you on the next one.